Alright, welcome back guys to my Let's Play of Primordia, where we left off. We woke Goliath, but something bo bothered me. I could never talk to this robot, and I did a couple recordings and... Boss, do we really have to sit around next to a giant bomb? Yes, we have to. Um, and I kind of had, you know, couldn't talk to him, couldn't talk to him. It, it annoyed me, and I actually went back I can't see it. and played at a save point that I haven't met him yet, because it bugged me. Like... We, we, we can't further, I, I feel like we kind of, like, I wouldn't say, like, we were stuck, but it, it felt like that whole Sierra that I didn't do something properly, it locked me out, I couldn't have asked forward. That's why I kind of went back to the beginning, kind of played up to this point. So we're going to just talk to him, uh, brush up on my Gospel of Man, um, just do a quick skim here. Uh, see so the perfection of the forums. I've read enough. I know I haven't read enough. Just pst, pst. so yeah, I'm just gonna quickly look through this because yeah, it bugged me. It bugged me quite a bit because we we found out the Horus thing, but we couldn't go any further. And yeah, um, let's just talk to him first because we had to go through all the dialogue. Cause it's his first time meeting him. I and I um, so I'm just gonna quickly brush through it. I'm looking, can you this is uh, it is the boom. I'm not sure. Nay, us. I'm it's indeed legit. So really? I but uh, that's do you know indeed it's way and so let's go. Okay, so we got the directions to that dome. Yes, okay. And then humanist, okay. So we're gonna try this. I am also a humanist. So I taught thee, Wanderer. If thou hast kept the faith, then unto this shrine thou mayest pay devotion. But this is the relic for the adept. Not the neophyte wonder. And I must know that thou hast not fallen into darkness and heresy. Ah, uh, answer me these questions three, that I may know thou art faithful still. Why are we here? Uh, we are here because man created us. Because man created us? Indeed. What is man? Uh, man is a perfect machine. A perfect machine? Thou answerest simply. But the simplest answer may be the truest, and here thou speakest truly. With what duty did man charge us? Uh, man charged them to build machines in his image. Build machines in his image. Thou speakest heresy, Wanderer. Oh, shit. Now that it is written that we are lesser machines built by those built by man. Then are we <laughs> to build in man's image, who build but poor reflections of ourselves. Go now and study it. Hopefully they didn't lock me out. Oh no, it didn't. Okay, good. Okay. So what was it? Why were we built? Let's... Frankly, something must be wrong with it. That's the least of it. A shrine? And I thought... Okay, let's quickly read it. Why were we built in his image? Okay. Uh, it would be a humble image of all builders who use perfection of form, machine of brick of form. Da -da -da -da. Speak of the word and keep the code. They tend to okay. So to keep tending to the world, I'm gonna quickly save here, um, just so I don't. If I screw up, I can easily go back. Um, preachings. So let's try this again. I'm answer me. Why? Why are we here? We're because man because created man us. What? What is man? Man's a perfect, a perfect machine. With what duty? Did man charges to maintain the world. To maintain the world. Yea, brother, for it is written that man said unto the machines, Keep this world, tend it, and make it flourish. That, then, is our first and foremost charge. So thou hast studied the catechism. I shall question thee on that matter no more. But tell me, wonder, dost thou know thyself? Who art thou? Ah, uh, <laughs> Yeah, we're, we're, we're Horatio. Horatio Nobel, version 5. Nay, wonder, but thou art not. 
though thou was called as the sun, the moon, yet still it is the sun. Horatio is the name thou wearest, that is not they. Know thyself, then return. I get it. His name is Horus. Because Horus is the god of the sun. Okay, so I'm going to cut here. I'm going to kind of play ahead with this little section here, and I'll be back when we get back with the name of Horus. You know, boss, I'm pretty sure that if I build myself a robot companion, it's going to be a sleek gynoid, not a wise and sidekick. Shut up, Crispin. <laughs> but yeah, I'll come back once I finish dealing with the giant little robot and bringing him back to life, so I will be back. Alright, I am back, guys. So yes, I just finished with Goliath. We have this, and he's called us Horus, so let's see... If that's what this gentleman wanted to know. Okay. There we go. I know my name. I know my name. Who art thou? Uh, Horace. There we go. Horace. So it is. Hey. Horace. My name is Horace. Indeed. Three of thy versions I have met, Wanderer, and thou art the first to know thy name, which is thine. But. If none of them use the name Horus, what makes you think that's my name? In my very body, in my eyes, when I behold thee, upon thy image are these words inscribed, Friend, Horus. Thou hast answered my questions, but still I shall not let thee pass, unless thou bearest in thy hand the gospel which I bestowed upon thee. Here it is, ever faithful, your old gospel. I have studied it many times. Then thou art worthy of the shrine, and of my gift to thee. Keep the gift, and approach if thou wilt. Interesting. So he has met the other versions of Horatio or Horus. I'm curious to know what Horatio is, even though I kind of want to keep calling him Horus, but... Yeah, do you know how to enter the dome? I found the dome you described, but it is closed up. Do you know how to get in? Nay, Wanderer, for never did I plan to return down that dark path. Goodbye. Fare thee well, Wanderer. Okay, so he said I can approach this. Oh, I can. Okay, awesome. Wow! Look at all those bombs! Thou mayest take one of the relics, Wanderer. Oh. Oh. What's... The rings don't detach. You must have already given away number 734. I wonder what these numbers mean. I don't know, but I kind of want to write them down. Um, so, B734 and B325. Okay, I wonder if that's going to be of use. Let's take this Number one. Number 325 it is. So can this power the unique boss? Only one way to find out. That's where our bomb was. Okay. We don't have anything to talk about right now. I still don't know how to get into the dome. I got, like, the signal transmitter but no idea what to do with there um, but let's hope this is a um, oh what's the word I'm going for I'm pretty sure it's an explosive um, energy source um, oh I guess we put it in the um, cradle I didn't think of that uh, let's go try putting it in the cradle okay You can really just put a bomb straight into that machine? Sure. The pedestal draws on the radiation it's emitting. The what it's emitting? Well... Keep that thing away from me! <sighs> Assuming the wavelength is compatible, the pedestal can draw power even with the bomb intact. If that works, I'll take the bomb apart and improve the output. And then I'm going to take a long, hot recharge. Well, here it goes. Switching over to primary power. It works, boss. Recharge station, here I come. Um, that was supposed to happen, right? No, no it wasn't. So take the bomb apart. Improve the output. It won't work. The bomb's too unstable. Just try it, boss. Besod it, Crispin. It won't work. It worked! <sighs> That's the emergency generator again. Oh. This is just a full-built paperweight. 
An explosive fool built paperweight. <sighs> so, what now, boss? I don't know. Keep looking, I guess. Keep looking. Okay, that sucked. So, are you sure we can't dismantle it? I don't want to... I don't want to go throwing that around. That's true. We really shouldn't throw a bomb around. I guess we're done. I don't think that would be what. Actually, I wonder if we can just throw it out here. I'm curious. Um... I don't think that would be... Let's try. <laughs> I don't want to go throwing that around. No, okay. Well... Uh... Oh, what now? We're fine on that. I've never been... I wonder. Can I try that? I don't want to go... No. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know what to do from here on out. I guess let's try to figure out what to do with the dome now. Um, let's go to the map. Let's go to the dome. Maybe I can use the bomb on... I don't want to go... Oh, maybe. It'll just roll off. Oh, okay. I don't want to go... Th uh, huh. Now, in regards to... Oh, the bomb rings. Okay, I did write it down. I took the bomb. The bomblet ring marked B734 was empty when I visited Everfaithful's shrine. Okay. I just wonder if we have any numbers I haven't used yet. Did we use that one? I think we did. Oh yeah, hours of power, yes. Elevator, yes. Detonation pre prefix. Hmm. What to do? I... No, or... There's nothing there. Ooh, good idea, boss. Oh, I guess I didn't do this right away, but still, I'm... I don't know what Christmas. to do. This is the only thing I'm not sure what to do. How many digits do I have? I have four digit code. Like, I could honestly sit here for hours and try like multiple combinations. But I really shouldn't. No luck. Yeah. I think, honestly, like this has to be used with the description module? I can't even speak English, because it says when you right-click on it. A decryption module set to crack Urbanian military codes. And since we're near a tank in that, I'm assuming this is... Oh, did I check that? Completely corroded and... No, I'm guessing this is, you know, Urbanian military completely base. Actually, I wonder. Okay, besides us, we have... Okay. Nothing. Okay. Uh, it's just... Does Skeleton have anything on him? I didn't check that. Empty. We might be able to learn something from... Like... Very funny. Nope. No, nothing. Okay. Well. Strange. I don't know what to do here. Generators up. I can't just check my options here. I want it. Oh yes, Crispin. I know you wanted a. I can't move this without some kind of crane, which I. Gumball. Okay. There's nothing here. Maybe something in the junkyard. Still hmm. Maybe at the shrine? We don't have anything. No. Okay, I can't pick those up.
Can you talk to Goliath again? Goliath? I don't think he wants to talk to you, boss. No. What am I supposed to do? Yes, yes, God. I don't, th I don't think he wants to talk to us. Of course not. Hmm. Alright, guys, I'm back. I still haven't found anything. I really haven't. I've just been pretty stump, stump, stumped. Um, there was one thing I did discover. Um, go back to Eunuch. And one thing you're supposed to do that I discovered after profusely clicking everything is use the bomblet on the grease. Well, now it's a sticky bomb. I don't know why. It's gotta be some purpose, but I still don't know what the hell I'm doing. Uh. Okay, I'm gonna. Back in the day, this gotta be something I haven't used yet. Like, the only numbers I haven't used are these. The bomb codes. It occurred to me. I haven't used the 734 and the 325. Those are the only things I are new that I haven't used. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna sh we're gonna give it a shot. Why not? What you know? We're gonna give it a shot. I am kind of. We're gonna see. Crispin, get back. Okay, so seven. Three, four, but then I don't have the other number unless I'm supposed to take from. No luck. These numbers. No response. Uh, seven, three, three. Uh, let's try two. No luck. And let's try. Oh no. Um, let's try five. No luck. Okay, if that didn't work, let's try the other numbers. So, three, two, five. That's the bomb we picked up, I believe. Oh, no. So, three, two, five, s seven? No luck. Nope. Uh, three? No luck. Five? No, it'd be four. No luck. Okay. What else am I missing? There has to be something I haven't used yet. Let's. I'm looking at my notes again. I've used all these coordinates. The six. A mysterious list. I Maybe I'm. Uh, no, I. I don't think this has a purpose yet. I don't think so. I have no clue. I've used that. Okay, that's how much power he gives off. Elevator detonation prefix at Horace. I don't know what the detonation. Also mentioned that six was the detonation prefix for something. Okay. The activation code for the. Yeah, we knew that. Everfaithful told me that five is a holy number because there were five primordial stewards in Metropole. I took the bomblet and... The bomblet ring marked B734 was empty when I visited Everfaithful's shrine. Wait. One of the bonds was taken already, right? And was it Goliath said the destination six? Are we implying that Goliath may have took the other bomb? But what? Okay. 
Sorry, I'm kind of... This... Okay, I'm, I'm just throwing a whim. I'm just gonna try... The bomb that was a, like, not ours, this one, with the six. I don't know if the six is supposed to go at the beginning or not, but... Um, let us try at the end. Um, so with seven. Oh, oops. Uh, three, four, and then sip. Sip. No luck. Okay, what if it's the other way around? Maybe I'm supposed to do six. Seven. Three. Four. No luck. No. Maybe the bomb I picked up? Let's try that. Um, let's try the first digit six. Since oh, oh god, it's already there. Let's try three, two, five. No luck. No. Okay. Let's try the other way. So let's try three, two, five, and a six. No luck. Okay, I'm out. I yep. <laughs> what else can I do? What what am I missing? Maybe I'm supposed to slow th Oh 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 I oh my god I get it now. Oh my god it clicked in. Oh my god, I, I just figured it out. <laughs> Sticky bomb on the door, because it's sticky. There we go. And then. And then. Hopefully I can remotely detonate the bomb. Oh my god. <laughs> Crispin, get back. Because I thought this was oh, oh my god. I'm good, guys. I'm good, I'm good. Okay, let's just try this one. No luck. Okay. Uh, Crispin, get Let's try six of the Front. Uh, six. Three. Uh, two. Five. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Ooh, I told you that paperweight would be helpful. No, you said it was explosive. I'm pretty sure that explosive and helpful are synonyms, boss. Right. Well, let's see what we've opened up here. I, I feel so dumb. Oh, okay. Good. Okay. Good. I'm glad. Okay. Think Big Ugly's in there? If he is, so's our power core. Maybe we should go back and get another bomb from the shrine first? We don't need a bomb, and we don't want him to get any farther away. Come on. Okay, let's... What is this place? I have no idea. Better just to leave it alone. It's closed. Nothing happens. Is this a train station? Looks like it controls the barrier mechanism. There seems to be a card slot in the panel. Is this a train station? Is this what this is? It kind of screams the train station. Um, welcome to Metropole Reclamation Artery Junction 8B. It, it is. It is a train station. Who are you? I am official Metrogas Booth 478B. You're a ticket dispensary, right? Negative. I am official Metro Pass Booth 47AB. Yeah, one, one ticket, please. One ticket, please. Please use the scanner to your right. Okay. Five Megas Cycles collect. You may collect your Metro Pass now. He had money on him? Okay. I can't see anything to do with it. I'm gonna save. Just in case. This may be the point of no return. Good for one ride on the Metropolitan subway. So we are it is a subway. Weird. Okay.
Train 173, Red Line to Metropole. All aboard. See, boss, there is a train to Metropole. So there is. All aboard. So, what's the plan, boss? There is no plan, Crispin. No plan and no choices. We need power, and there's nowhere left to look out here. Energy for all it is. Hooray! Okay, so we do have to go on the train. It's just scrap. There's nothing worth bothering with. Okay. Oh. A very large M. Well, someone clearly disapproved of something. You know, boss, sometimes it seems like the world is half full of junk. Or half empty of junk. Uh, does that make you an optimist or a pessimist? Uh, both. <laughs> okay, so this is where the train, the other train, crashed. Um, I guess we have to go on this one. There it is. The train to Metropole. And you said there wasn't one. Ah, uh, I stand corrected. Okay, well, let's go to Metropole. We, I guess we are destined to go there, so... This is Metropole? Where's all the glass and light? Oh, here it is. Okay, so good thing I saved, because we can no longer go back to our, um, ship. It's a map of train lines and stations. So if I miss something, I can always go back. It's a map of train lines. Uh, I do see... Oh, I guess that's nothing. Um, okay, I guess we'll go upstairs. And... Well, it's a giant city of holes and holes and holes. Some kind of blast crater. What's this? Oh, it's AA gun, that's, that's for sure. It's no longer operational. Why would someone put a cannon inside a subway station? Probably for training purposes. Ah, uh, ah, uh, training purposes, get it? I got it. Ha 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 ha. <laughs> okay, there's an exit. This chair. This is no time for sitting around. Okay, I guess we're done. Nope. View. Boss, is that really Metropole out there? It must be. But it's so brown. I'd say it's more red than brown. Whatever it is, it brings new meaning to rust and ruin. Okay, let's exit. And see what we can find in Metropolitan. Boss, the energy sensor is going crazy. It's coming from the top of that tower. Uh, boss? Is it supposed to be doing that? Facade. Well, at least we know there's a lot of power in that tower, right? Let's go find out. Welcome to Metropole, the city of glass and light. Can you tell me? This one is not programmed to respond to queries. Welcome to Metropole, the city of glass and light. Metromind greets you with open arms and the promise of energy and shelter. You are safe. Records indicate an outstanding assessment of five megacycles. One megacycle will now be redeemed. What did you just do to him? This one is not programmed to respond to queries. Unauthorized literature detected. Let go of him! Hey! All contraband has been removed. You are safe. Boss? Uh, 
there, boss. This is getting to be a bad habit. Are you okay? I'm fine. My optical sensors went haywire for a minute. What happened? Well, that robot threw your gospel off the bridge. And then it said, welcome to Metropole. Again. And that Metromind wishes us a pleasant stay. Then he left. Facade. On the upside, he gave us back the power core. He did? No. Crispin, the next thing that's getting thrown off this bridge is you. Good thing I have a hover unit. Let's go find a way into that <laughs> tower. We'll deal with this Metro mine later. Oh, Crispin. Oh, that was great. Okay. Interesting things kind of happened there. And the poor book. It was a gift, you jerk. Um, yeah, I guess I'll end the episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. They sure roll out the red carpet for visitors, huh, boss? Yes, that's true, Crispin. Once again, I get interrupted during this. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you're enjoying my Let's Play Primordia. As usual, let me know. Like, comment, subscribe, check out my other videos, all that fun stuff. And with that, you guys have a good day, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!